Okay, so I uh, unscrewed the cable connection and there's still a power connection to the wine guard. So I'm going to uh, cut that, then we'll abandon it in place and cover it with Dicor. I also want to add that uh, this power to the uh, wine guard booster it has uh, a negative and a positive so this is basically hot so um, we're going to uh, you know seal those ends uh, and then also I'm going to look for the fuse position in the fuse panel um, to see if uh, I can just pull the fuse as well to kill it but if um, the fuse powers more than one one item besides the wine guard then um, sealing these up will, will be fine so you can't have any um, you won't have any power uh, you know potential shorts or anything okay I'm up here on the roof uh, we've removed all the solar panels as you can see And the solar panels we removed are the ZAMP solar panels. Um, so uh, now we're cleaning the roof. And what we use to clean the roof is uh, ZEP mold and mildew cleaner. And as you can see, this side hasn't been cleaned. And this side uh, has been cleaned except for my foot feet prints. Um, and then the other thing that we use to get the remaining die core stickiness, you know, like that, off the roof, is uh, mineral spirits. And you'll see, uh, once we get this all cleaned up, how clean the roof is after we're done. Okay, the ZAMP, um, basically the ZAMP connections for the solar are just attached with three screws. Um, so you unscrew it and come up and then you'll have a hole. Uh, these are where the, these are number 10 wires, um, or should be number 10 wires. And uh, so um, we're going to cut these off as close as we can for the, for the MC4 connectors that we'll use with the uh, Bouge RV panels. And, um, you know, then seal this area up with a cover. Okay, so we have uh, gotten the roof all clean. You can see it's a lot uh, more shiny and white and clean looking. And here are the um, wires that we left from the ZAMP. Uh, connection that we'll be connecting MC4 cables on for the new Bouge RV panels. So, ZEP and Mineral Spirits. Took us uh, about an hour to clean them. Okay, I'm going to start putting together the solar panels. We use, uh, I, I recommend, and so CTM Customs is using uh, the Bouge RV 100 watt. 9 BB solar panels. Um, they have a half, half cut cell technology that they use. And so they get almost 20% more output um, over their rating um, as other brands. So, so these are um, very good performing solar panels.
Okay, so I put two feet on, and I'll turn it around so Okay, so we are getting the solar panels in place. We've used um, a turnabon tape to tape over all the little screw holes that the old panels left. We've gone ahead and wired, um, put the new the new connectors on uh, for the wires that were sticking up out of the roof. Okay, so we've wired these panels up in series, uh, this pair, and now we're going to connect uh, a six foot standard solar uh, wire with MC4 connectors and a three foot to bring us to this 